<laughs> so we finally bought our first house first we've done it so guys hello welcome back to my channel we are officially homeowners, homeowners. oh my god, god how crazy is it? that to say yeah. we have been mm -hmm. on a crazy long journey so super long we're coming to you right at the end mm-hmm we never thought it would end. We didn't. That's the problem. We didn't think we would get to this point, to be honest. So, I've been editing back the clips this morning, and you know, the first clip we filmed was in April. April. Guys, we, we are now in December, oh, so... Nice. <laughs> we completed on our house on the 15th of December. So From April? From April. That's crazy. It is what it is. We are here now. We're so, so excited, aren't yeah, we? Yeah, we are. Oh we are. We can't wait. We're literally so happy. Buzzing. We're officially homeowners and we've got the keys, but... Where are they? Hang on. Yeah, it's not official out. until we actually get the keys out. out. Let's show the keys. <laughs> oh, it hasn't got a little key ring on oh, it. No, it we haven't got the key we ring on it because we're going to go get a few different copies of it cut. But we had these little first home mm -hmm. keys. Um, and yeah, basically we just wanted to come and film an intro to this video. This video is basically just a little bit of our journey. We filmed a couple of clips here and there. Obviously, it kind of got to the point where there wasn't too many updates we could give because no. it was literally just handing it over to solicitors. The thing that took oh, so, long so long was solicitors. Mm. I don't. Need, there's no advice we can tell you to try and make it, like what made it longer, how to make just it. Just be patient. I think that's the only thing we could do. You just have to be patient. Because there were times where we were like, it's <sighs> never going to end. It felt it's just never going to like... end. It felt scary because we were literally basically a week away yeah. from losing our mortgage which if you know the current climate at the moment was a really scary thing because we mm. thought if we don't if it ends are we even going to be approved for another mortgage so that got a little bit scary but we we stayed positive yeah and we, we managed it all week we managed, before yeah before they closed not, yeah not before it also christmas. was going to close for christmas our mortgage but, offer ran out at the end of december so yeah so it would have been we were tight for time we were tight but yeah. we manifested it, we put it out mm -hmm. into the universe, we were meant to be here, yep. we were meant to be here in this moment, we were, yeah, we're going to be starting the new year with a really amazing new a big chapter. Project. Yeah. yeah, a big project, so a new chapter, yeah. you guys are going to see lots of content from us, it's not going to be coming straight away just because, you know, our own personal things, it's going to be coming in the new year, but you guys are going to see it, that's why I wanted to let you guys know. Yeah. We are going to be doing moving vlogs, there will be a house tour before because Basically, this house is going to be a renovation project, so... Big one. We have bought a free bedroom house, which we're just so blessed for, mm -hmm. and it's a renovation project, which again, is something we've always wanted, haven't we? We mm. just personally, we didn't want to go down the new build route, we wanted a sort of older house that we could put our own stamp on. Which made on. it a little bit harder, I think. Made it a bit harder, mm. again, in the current climate, there just wasn't a lot around, but we've been blessed with... An amazing house which will be a renovation project yeah. so yeah there's it's basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna strip the whole thing aren't we we're gonna start again we're gonna make it our own we've got so many ideas we've spent the last however many months pinteresting <laughs> pinning stuff yeah getting ideas doing a little bit of home shopping here and there so and that's the cool thing because we would like we're not when we're not together we'll say right we'll pinterest this evening and then we'll look back at each other's. Yeah, we'd come back together like, and we'd like, go for each other's. Yeah, which is good. <laughs> we'd always have which to say what it is. So yeah, yeah we've got good. similar ideas. Um, we're so blessed as well that Marcus's dad is going to be mm -hmm. a huge help and you're yeah. going to help and you're going to do it with him. I'm yeah. going to get involved as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what's so fun mm -hmm. about this, I think. It's going to be a reno where we can literally start again and we'll make, it make it exactly how we want. We're going to make exactly this house around. our home. Mm -hmm. Whether it's for our forever home, we don't know. Probably, maybe not, but it's going to be our home for, for a, a while, very long time. Very, very long time. We see ourselves being here for a long time, especially with the fact that we can make our own. Mm. But yeah, when I say we're literally strewing it back and we're going back to basics, we're, Brick we're going from step one. We're yeah. literally going to be doing everything. So mm -hmm. you guys are going to see that. Which is fun. Fun it's for you lots so too. Fun. Yeah, it'll, it'll be, be so fun. It'll be so fun. Lots of moving vlogs and just renovating the whole mm. house so we will of course show you the befores and that'll be so nice for us to look at the before and afters when afters when we get there mm. and at the beginning it's, we're obviously blessed that we can still sort of live at home whilst we're doing bits that's a big house. thing that's there's no rush there, there is no rush. because there is, we'll be paying a mortgage and we'll be paying a mortgage every month yeah we want to we want to um, live together as soon as possible yeah, we've, we've looked forward to this moment yeah since the beginning of our relationship but, but we even more make so, it right. yeah even more so yeah. this year whilst we've known we're in the process of buying a house yeah. it's at the beginning of this video, you know, we were saying we were so were we nervous. Were we in the car? We were in, that, we're we're in, the, we're car. in the car, sorry, yeah, and yeah. we were like, we're so nervous, but now I'm just so excited no, because we've had wait. so long to process it yeah. now, haven't we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so excited to just get in there, get going, so I promise you guys it will be coming, 
but I just want you to enjoy our little few clips we did film, mm -hmm. mostly for ourselves, but also for you guys to see. Yeah, it was a long process. It we was. will at some point do a QA and a of whatever you guys want to know for first time buyers. That is us. Mm -hmm. It's been quite tough. There's been things that we've just had, we've had to learn the whole, pro whole process, haven't we really? Mm. We have so. had the help of other people and I know not a lot of people have that. So that we've help. Been lucky to have people help us along yeah. the way, our families. Because it, it is difficult and I'm not saying it's not because we probably it would have taken a hell of a lot longer if we didn't. Yeah, if we didn't know anything like that we had the help from mm. others that would have yeah. been even longer but But you know it is doable. It is, it is doable. doable. And we're we're proving you know, we're the proof, proof of, of that. that, yeah. yeah. Cause yeah, well, at, yeah. And at, the, at the beginning of the video, obviously, you were only 21, now you are 22. I'm 23, just about to turn 24 in January, so Jeez. we're really proud of ourselves mm -hmm. for doing it at this point in at our lives. Point, yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Saving for the whole time being mm. together, we've save, 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 and mm -hmm. I'm really proud of us. We've worked really hard for this, so. Here yeah. we go, this is it. Here we go, guys, this is our journey this is it. of our first home together, mm -hmm. so. Enjoy this video and we will be coming at you very soon with a house tour and reno vlogs. So I'm so, so excited. Um, I can't wait. It's going to be good. It's going to be wait. good. So enjoy the video, guys. And I just wanted to look what the date was. Oh, what okay. is the date? 22nd of April. 22nd, Friday. The 22nd. <laughs> there we go. 12 minutes past three. <laughs> Nothing wrong. Hey guys, so today is Friday the 22nd of April and <laughs> I'm guessing there would have been an intro to this video but I kind of wanted us to just vlog our whole process of obviously what is about to happen so as you guys would have known by now we are buying our first house we are about to become first time buyers Scary, Content you yeah. think? Yeah. I feel like all emotions at the moment Yeah, yeah, yeah yeah, tell me about how you feel. I don't know, it's a bit surreal at the moment. Yeah, it's very surreal. I think I'm feeling... So basically, let's just chat about this. So this is our second appointment at the Mortgage Advisors. This one is to pretty much kind of like finalise our mortgage, like basically sign yeah. a mortgage. The first time we went, we just went to get some advice on how much we could borrow. Um, that was, yeah, literally just kind of like... Just to see what... Just a chat with him. Yeah, just to see where we were at. Yeah, In what terms we could of like what sort we of could be looking for. Looking for, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so because this is the second meeting, I don't feel as nervous as I did on the first one. Did you feel quite oh, nervous? Oh, no, I'm more that? nervous now. Really? Yeah. I don't, yeah, I don't know. I feel well, no, more excited I, I now. I know that we're going to like, we're going to come yeah, out this of is this quite and serious. get something from it. Not that we didn't get anything in the first time. Obviously, yeah. we got a lot. Because yeah. we've got a, you know, an idea mm -hmm. of what we could afford and what we could look at based on what he was sort of like benchmarking the last mm. time we were there. But, but this that... time, now this time round, it's going to be like finalised. Yeah, true. Do you know what I mean? I just felt like the first time we didn't even know if we... I thought no, we, I might, we might have unknown. come out of that disappointed. Yeah. We didn't, but I felt nervous yeah, because okay. of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I feel like at that point, we kind of... So basically, we, we kind of thought we'd maybe move out next year, didn't we? Um, yeah. Not that we didn't want to, but we just thought money-wise. Obviously, yeah. now an opportunity has come up. We've obviously jumped at it, but of, it'd be stupid not to. Yeah, and no, that's why I was kind of thinking like back then because that was like right. when we first heard about it. I felt more nervous then, but now like we've had more time to like get excited about it and mm. like discuss it more and go and see the property and things like that. I feel like way more excited now. Yeah. Yep. So yeah, pretty much we are today going to the mortgage advisors. So wanted to just vlog this part of it. We've just got ourselves ready. I'm just kind of in a little crop blazer, um, some nice trousers. So for those of you who might want to know who are also first time buyers like us, um, the kind of checklist of things that you need to bring along is your last three months of pay slips, your last three months bank statements, form of ID, and we also brought our P60s. Is there anything else we've brought? I've just Did brought you say a passport? Little yeah, I've already forgotten you've literally said it five <laughs> And I also just brought a little notepad and pen because you never know, you might want to write something down. But yeah, that's what we've come prepared of today. So yeah, are you feeling excited? I'm feeling excited. Yeah, yeah. nervous, nervous. As I said, more nervous than I was the first time. Really? Or just, uh, definitely. Just because it is just quite a serious thing, I guess. You know, yeah. we are new to this, so we are going to be learning on the way. We're going to be chatting you guys through everything. So hopefully this might help one of you. But yeah, it's going to be a process and we want to bring you guys along literally the whole journey. And and I think it's crazy just quick, this is the first step into the journey. I think you're, you're more nervous than me, but in the same, like, sort of like, you're more nervous than me in the sense that you always think about how, you know, you've worked all this time and then all of a sudden it's just going. 
Yeah, that is oh, something that, that like, has to, but then have to go has ahead to around, but yeah, also happen, like this, like I want you guys, well, not that it matters, but also just to say this is something that we've literally spoken about, you know, mm. since, you know, pretty much getting together because we've always known how much we love each other and how much we see a future together. So yeah, this has been something we've been talking about for a yeah. long time, something we know we really want to do, especially around this time in our lives, to be at the ages we are. So currently I'm 23 and you're 21. To be able to be in this position is just amazing. And I think it's gonna be fun, it's exciting. I'm, yeah, all the emotions. I think it's gonna be really cool to have our own property yeah. together. So yeah, today's the 22nd of April, we will see how long the process pans out. I know obviously it's longer than you intentionally inspect, but we're not, yeah. I think it's like, don't expect and then you're not disappointed, are you? So yeah. <laughs> obviously it's gonna be, it's different for everyone. And still we will keep you guys updated, but yeah. Looking forward to it. Me too. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> love and you. Ned, I love you. Let's go. Rock and roll. Hello guys. So it is just me coming in for an update. Today is the 31st of May. So last thing you would have seen was me and Marcus, we went to the mortgage advisors. I can't remember the date of that now. I feel like it was at the end of April. But last time we thought we were going, we thought we were going to be able to do the mortgage application kind of thought things were going to be flowing from then i feel like with this whole house buying malarkey you have to kind of take everything with a pinch of salt and just kind of like expect there to be bumps in the road and things not to ever really go as smoothly as you think pretty much there was just like a couple of issues that that time we couldn't actually do the mortgage application we ended up having to go away sorting a few things out then we obviously ended up going on holiday we've just been to Tenerife for the week so obviously that kind of pushed back putting in a new appointment but today's the day we're back at the mortgage advisor Marcus is actually meeting me here because we've both come separately from work we're meeting here going to the appointment from here but pretty much hopefully fingers crossed today is the day we're getting that mortgage application in place then we can finish all our forms for the solicitor and hopefully things are going to get moving kind of swiftly from there I'm hoping for some kind of like timeline a little bit like just no dates a little bit more on my head i know it's still probably going to be like a few months but yeah i feel like it's going to feel super exciting after today if we get this mortgage application in place so yeah again it's the kind of thing don't really know what to expect but this is why i'm documenting the journey hopefully letting you guys know a little bit more i feel like obviously everyone's journey is going to be different and yeah it's been pretty crazy so far it's a thing where they just don't teach you enough in school and i feel like i've definitely not known enough about the process so i'm kind of like obviously glad i'm learning now to hopefully if i ever move again know the process a little bit better but where as well like i work from home i feel like i've taken on quite a lot of the pressure um in comparison to Marcus, which is obviously absolutely fine. Like I know I'm obviously more like in the position to take some of it on. He doesn't work from home. So I've had to deal with all like the emails, calls, all that. And sometimes I feel like people are just talking about things and I'm literally like, I don't have a clue what you're talking about. <laughs> like I'm not scared to admit it because I feel like it is just something we just don't learn enough about. And yeah, I'm not gonna lie. There's been a lot of stuff that I haven't really had a clue about, but I'm getting there with it guys. Hopefully there's gonna be good progression from today, but yeah, I will probably vlog after we've been in the appointment with Marcus, just to give you an update if we do get the mortgage application in place. I'm very excited. Fingers crossed everything goes smoothly. And yeah, let's continue this journey. So guys, I'm back in the car, back from the appointment. I am solo again. Cause like I said, me and Marcus came in separate cars, so he's on a different level. Just about to leave the car park, going back to his, but it's good news the application went ahead all fine managed to get like the office and everything we wanted it was sort of more positive than we even thought and yeah i'm so so happy that that's been accepted and it's gone through all okay so yeah really positive really good super happy super smiley i feel like yeah fingers crossed like i keep saying it's gonna just go smoothly from here but yeah Today was positive. It's been a good afternoon. We will check in when we have another update, but mortgage application is accepted. So guys, today is September the 10th and we haven't done an update since May. Is that when it's been? Yeah. So May was when we last filmed. That was when we last went Long to time. the mortgage advisors. Obviously, do you remember it was just as we came off holiday? So it was kind of like, that was a little bit delayed as we kind of yeah. found out we needed to go whilst we were on holiday. 
so we booked in after that and obviously you saw that was good news we got accepted for our mortgage which that was really exciting mm -hmm. wasn't it yeah it was and now we're in september since we've just been on another holiday which is really fun but yeah it's pretty much just been at the stage where it's been like a bit of a waiting game yeah. hasn't it yeah so, that's what it's been so it's, it's kind of difficult because we can't there's not been too much anything. to yeah update we can't do anything ourselves to sort of push mm. the process along i'm sure most of you know who have been in the house buying process you will know that just is the case for most houses once it gets like put with the solicitors you just have to wait so um we obviously had to fill out some paperwork that sort of stuff do loads of our paperwork really we've boring stuff. yeah all that boring stuff um setting that all off and then they were ready to do the searches and we had to sort of like go back and forth on that a little bit but yeah, then they kind of just said, oh, it take like six to eight weeks, wasn't it? So in that time, you're just kind of like sat thinking, do I need to like email? Like yeah, I want you, an update, I mean, but then there probably like isn't an update to give because no. they're just getting on with their thing, aren't they? No, so there, there was a time to be fair when it was like, I think we were probably at the six week mark mm. and we just emailed them just to be like, how's it going kind of thing. Yeah, and I think there was a, um, again a little bit of a hiccup, wasn't there? Like some yeah, paperwork. Yeah, which is always going to happen, yeah. I think. I think you're always bound to have problems along the way. We've certainly had our fair few. Yeah, we've had a few problems, a um, few like extra delays, but yeah, yeah so how, how many is. months is that? Four? Four. So yeah, we've been kind of waiting four months since the mortgage was accepted. Mm -hmm. But yeah, so the next kind of stages for us really is just like making sure the mortgage office in place with the solicitors i guess sorting out the last bit of paperwork and then pretty soon i feel like should be our completion date so i feel like it is starting to kick in now Do you think real... for me? really yeah. i feel like so you know before we were kind of a bit like a mixed bag of emotions like in our last clips we probably were saying quite a lot like oh like nervous but excited but now i just where we've had a few months for it to sit in i just feel mm. like really excited now no i think it'll be when we get the keys and even then i don't think it'll quite yeah, but like, aren't you feeling like even oh, yeah. more excited now yeah, just because 100%. it does feel a little bit more in like well, touching closer. reach? Yeah. yeah, so in these few months, we've been doing a little bit of shopping here and there. We have mm. like a list on our phone of like house buying things, which is quite a big it's list. It's only like if we saw them. I don't think we Yeah, but this is what way. I'm saying. So like we have the list, but here and there, we've just been mm. buying sort of like decorative bits because yeah. there's some stuff we're like we can't buy because we haven't made decisions on like what the kitchen's gonna look like the bathroom it's like we don't want to buy stuff and then regret it because mm. we're like mm, we don't really like that anymore it's not going to go with this so there's just been little bits and bobs on the way which i'm so excited to be able to bring home wet hauls how fun is that, that is gonna, gonna be, be that i will definitely be doing that straight away i'll do like a whole like collective home wear haul of like bits i picked up but we also just thought today we're gonna pop out shopping which we quite like to do sometimes mm -hmm. and yeah we just like pop in the homeware shop so even sometimes just places like b and m has just got a really good home section at the moment yeah. for autumn um where else we go done elm primark home we love so i thought i could just bring you guys along a little shop with us like i say we don't pick up loads it's just if we really see something mm. we like isn't it when the home content is full in swing we're gonna do a whole come to ikea with us because how fun is that gonna <sighs> that's be? gonna be so much that's fun. when we're I gonna buy like all the proper stuff like loads of yeah. stuff we're gonna do a massive shop so but that's when we know where everything's going yeah 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 is, when you know. we're like and obviously we've got the keys because we're not just gonna yeah leave flat packs all over yeah 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 we're gonna bedroom. wait till that because obviously yeah that's the thing as well there's nowhere to put stuff really mm. we're just sat in my bedroom now like crazy one day this is, will be the last time god it's gonna feel weird coming so back weird. here like, yeah like when empty. we're actually moved out i wonder what your mum's gonna do with it yeah we'll be emotional but that'll be at another time so we just wanted to come in update you where we're at the moment yeah. so things are moving forward things are moving forward we're just waiting and i'm sure the next few clips you'll see will maybe be when we have the completion day oh, that'd be sick. so exciting so catch you guys in a bit when we go and do a little bit of home shopping we're gonna pick up these waffle tea towels because i like the colors and they're only four pounds quite nice quality as well actually yeah look good so we're just going to have a quick look around the home section in Primark. They have some really nice storage baskets which we quite like. I think there's some in the sale as well which is quite good. Like this is actually only £4. That's quite nice isn't it babe? Yeah we've already got one don't we? Yeah. I mean that would be for something different though it's a different size but yeah we got a little basket to put some frozen but that's quite good that that's in the sale. New nice vases. I like these but I want one that's like a little bit thicker. 
some pretty candles, quite like the gold on that. And we got oh, yeah, home. we got um, something similar to this that said home on it. I'll show it in one of my homeware hauls, but again, two pounds. This candle looks good. I'm gonna give it a smell. I like the look of it. Mm. Smells like um, yeah, it smells just like washing powder. Washing powder yeah. Um, lots of these candles candlesticks if you had a nice candle holder so having a look in B&M and they actually have some really nice bathroom bits like I really really like these soap dispensers and where you'd like hold your toothbrushes and also they've got some really nice hand towels oh and this bath rack this is nice you like that it's only eight pounds like the little wooden ones like a wooden one yeah. yeah but also really really nice bath mats we've seen quite a few that we've liked in B&M haven't we but Again, it might be something we wait to buy, but like this feels so nice and soft. I like that one, don't we? Mm. And that one. So yeah, some good bathroom this bits. Kind of like classic, isn't it? Yeah, it's quite simple. Even that I like. Mm. Or a little circle, like semi-circle one. Cute, it's nice. You might want something a bit more like this because like white probably get dirty. Yeah, that is true. So that colour might be quite good. Yeah, definitely happy, thank you. Okay, lovely. Thanks so much. I'll speak with Mr. Hawes and then what I'll do is I'll give you another call and we'll uh, essentially be sending the monies over now to the seller solicitors and then once it's arrived with them, we'll have a call and exchange contracts and complete at the same time. So uh, it shouldn't be too long, really, but say a few hours to go through and I'll give you another call today. You know. Okay, that's perfect. Thank you very much. Oh, no worries at all. Thank you Thank for your you, time. Speechy, and thank you. Yeah, bye. 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 Just had the call guys. Oh my god, I need to message Marcus, hang on. So they just gave me the call. Well, they obviously wanted to speak to us both, but Marcus is at work, I'm working as well from home today. Sorry, I literally, I'm looking really crazy. My hair's all fluffy, but I feel like I'm speechless because I'm just like, oh my god, I can't believe it. So today is a December the 15th and it's our completion day, finally. You guys are probably thinking, the last time we spoke to you, I don't even know when it was. I feel like it must have been, I don't know, was it even September? Was it July? It was definitely like I was in a blazer and a t-shirt or something like that. And now I'm in a winter jumper because it's absolutely freezing. But we finally got there. I just wanted to quickly get my camera out whilst they called for that. And I'm also going to try and get it out when I get the actual full completion call, which he, don't know if you guys just heard, he said, won't be long. I can't believe it's finally here like we've been through so many ups and downs with this journey like you can tell it's actually taken so many months we've gotten so close to our mortgage date even running out so that was a little bit scary especially with like the current climate but we finally made it i feel like i'm getting emotional but like i want to literally wait until i get that full full call to say it has been completed but I've just given my confirmation authority to say yeah the purchase is going through so we're basically nearly homeowners everything that I've been working towards saving for wanting with Marcus for the whole of our relationship so far yeah that's everything we've been working towards and wanted so feeling super grateful and happy right now so completion day is finally here December 15th <laughs> we're gonna have to do a whole massive update of like the whole journey and let you guys know about our house buying journey do a little Q&A or something but I'm so so excited to be able to finally let you guys know and I'm so excited for the home content I'm so excited to make a house at home with Marcus yeah I'll speak to you guys when they call me for the actual phone call so we've just uh, exchanged and completed there. Um, sorry for the delay. The seller solicitors uh, were just not getting back to us. And we've exchanged and completed. So you can collect the keys whenever you're ready. Oh, that's great. Thank you so much. All right, no worries. Thank you so Perfect. much. Perfect. Thank you very much. Bye. 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 My heart is racing. Mostly because I was trying to also like turn on the camera when my phone was ringing because oh, I've been literally waiting for that call all day, guys. Oh my god, I'm shaking. I need to call Marcus and tell him. Oh my god. We just bought our first house. 
we're officially homeowners. Yeah, so since that call at half nine this morning, I've only just received the call at half two. As you would have heard, they just said there was a little bit of a delay, but I feel like it's like not sinking in, but it also is, and I feel like it would be sinking in way more if Marcus was here with me right now. But oh my god, we've just bought our first house! Oh my god, this is so exciting, guys! I feel like this is such a huge achievement. I, yeah, like I said at the beginning of this, these clips, I just feel like this is exactly everything that we've been working towards this is like she's something we've spoken about since day one of being together yeah so i'm probably just gonna go and call marcus now off camera um just because i want to just have a little chat with him and update him and let him know but yeah oh my god i will try and record a clip when i'm with him or we're gonna like i've done an intro or something together um but yeah if there's no clips after this I guess I will see you guys for the moving content. I'm going to be doing moving vlogs. I want to do like homeware hauls. I would have told you guys like the content I want to bring you guys. But yeah, just expect lots of house moving content to come. Oh my god, I'm so excited. 